वेलकम टू अरोरा केमिस्ट्री फॉर एवरी वन लेट एस सी बैलेंसिंग ए केमिकल रियाक्शन विच इनवॉल्व कंबर्शन ऑफ ग्लूकोज मॉलिक्यूल फॉर बैलेंसिंग एनी केमिकल रियाक्शन देर इज ए बेसिक प्रिंसिपल बिहाइंड लॉ ऑफ कंजर्वेशन ऑफ मास विच स्टेट दैट मास कैन नेदर बी क्रिएटेड नॉर बी डिस्ट्रॉयड दिस मीन्स नंबर ऑफ रियाक्टन शुड बी इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ प्रोडक्ट्स इन दिस इक्वेशन सो दिस साइड इज ए रियाक्टन साइड एंड दिस इज ए प्रोडक्ट साइड दिस वी कैन कीप इट लाइक लेफ्ट हैंड साइड एंड right hand side let us write that left hand side atoms of an element 1 by 1 carbon you can see that uh, there is a number which is written below isn't it so this we called as a subscript this tells about the number of atoms of an element coefficient is the number which is written just before that uh, chemical formula of a compound or a molecule so here it is nothing written means uh, there is a one molecule of glucose is present so number of atoms of carbon 6 hydrogen we have the 12 hydrogen atoms then for oxygen we can see here 6 and here 2 so 6 plus 2 8 oxygen atoms same order we are going to write it for the right hand side also carbon we have only one carbon atom and for hydrogen there are two hydrogen atoms then for oxygen here 2 and here 1 so 2 plus 1 we have total 3 oxygen atoms now we go to draw a column between left hand side and right hand side and we go to write the difference between left hand side atoms and right hand side atoms if you maintain this column this definitely will help you to solve that balancing the equation very easily and very correctly also so for carbon here 6 and here 1 so 6 minus 1 5 same way for hydrogen 12 minus 2 10 for oxygen here 8 then here 3 that means 5 if it is zero the atom is balanced if it is not zero in the difference column then we need to multiply with a suitable number until we get that atom is balanced for example for carbon 6 here but in the right hand side we have that 1 so to make that equal that means to make that carbon atom 6 in the right hand side we need to multiply with 6 then we will get 6 this number as a coefficient we are going to write that compound containing carbon so here carbon dioxide 6 when you are writing the number of oxygen atom also immediately changing 6 to 12 already we have that 1 so 13 so cut and write 13 now now what happened to the carbon atoms it is equal So the difference is not five. Six minus six, zero. Now come to hydrogen atom. Here twelve, but in the right hand side two. So to make it twelve, if you multiply with the six, you will get twelve. Is it? So this six as a coefficient, we are going to write that compound containing hydrogen. So that means here H two. So write six H two. So what happened to that uh, difference column? 12 minus 12, it is not 10, 0. But what happened to that oxygen atom? The number of oxygen atom also changing. Already we have that 6 to 12. Now one more 6 oxygen atom. So 12 plus 6, 18. So 13 you cut and immediately you write 18. So 18 minus 8, the difference is not 5, it is 10 now. Now let us move to oxygen atom. oxygen in the left hand side we have 8 but in the right hand side we have that 18 but uh, here you should see that uh, oxygen atoms are present in in c6h12o6 and oxygen molecule also but if you see this one carbon and hydrogen already balanced is it so instead of changing that oxygen atom in glucose molecule now we are going to change that coefficient in oxygen molecule only so already in that oxygen molecule we have that two oxygen atom is it now we go to multiply 2 by 6 so we will get 2 6 sir 12 so 12 plus 6 it is not 8 we will get 18 okay so this 6 as a coefficient we are going to write front of o2 oxygen molecule now see the difference here 18 and in the right hand side also 18 so 18 minus 18 0 it means we got zero for all the atoms of the element 
it is completely balanced but for a safer side let us check that once again left hand side atom with right hand side atoms so carbon in the left hand side six then in the right hand side also six hydrogen here 12 then this side also 12 then for oxygen here we have that 18 oxygen atoms in the right hand side also we have 18 oxygen atom so the complete balanced equation for this reaction is C6H12O6 plus 6O2 that gives 6CO2 plus 6H2O. Thanks for watching.